A, point A is 3, 1, and B is 0, negative 5. They both lie on the graph y equals 2x minus 5. Determine whether each point is collinear with points A and B. Okay. So if I have my coordinate plane, x and my y axis, um, my point A is going to be 3, 1. There's A. B is going to be 0, negative 5. Okay, so right there. There's B. They both lie on the graph y equals 2x minus 5. So if I graph, if I draw a line through these points, okay, that's going to be the, the line for this equation y equals 2x minus 5. And you're just going to determine whether each point is collinear with the points A and B. Now, collinear means that they're going to be on the same line, right? So uh, we're just going to see if these three points, since we know that these points A and B are on this line, uh, you want to just see if these three points are going to also be on the line. Okay? And if they are, then they will be collinear with the points. Okay? So for point C, now um, instead of graphing the line and, and um, seeing if that point lies on the line, you can just, since you know that this is x and this is your y, you can just plug it into the equation and see if it works. So y equals 2x minus 5, you're just going to plug in negative 1 for x and 4 for y. So 4 equals 2 times negative 1 minus 5. So here this says uh, 4 equals a negative 2 minus 5. Uh, do we know that does 4, okay, and then since we don't know that these are equal, um, does 4 equal negative 7? No, it does not. So this point does not lie on this line. So that means point C is not collinear. This is uh, no. Okay. For point D, I'm going to also plug in. So, so um, negative or seven is my y. Okay. So seven equals two times six minus five. So seven. Okay, I'm going to put a question mark over my equal sign just because I'm not sure if it does yet. So I can't say that it equals. This is twelve minus five. So seven equals seven. So this is yes. It is collinear with the points. And then my last point, point E, so negative 15 equals 2 times negative 5 minus 5. Okay, put a question mark again. Negative 10 minus 5. So negative 15 does equal negative 15. So this is also yes, okay? So points D and E are collinear with points A and B since they all fall or they're all on the line um, y equals 2x minus 5. Okay? So that's it for this lesson. Thank you for watching educator.com.